Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing empties, hits and misses. My empties bag is full of all of my beauty trash. So if you are new here, hello, welcome. <laughs> uh, pretty much I'm gonna share with you all of my empties and tell you if I love them, if I hate them, will I repurchase or not? So let's go ahead and dive right in. My bag is full. It's about ready to overflow, so I knew it was time to film this video. I have a whole playlist of my empties, hits, and misses, so definitely check that out. I'll be sure to link that playlist down below in the description box. Make sure to go watch some more beauty trash empties. So grab a drink, grab a snack, girlfriend. Let's go ahead and go through my beauty trash. So first thing we have here are two body washes. I finally finished this one. This is from Jason, Jason Naturals, and it's Dehydrating Gluten-Free Body Wash. I originally purchased this because it was fragrance-free. I like to have a fragrance-free body wash on hand just for those days where I feel like my skin is extra sensitive. So I finished this up. I don't know if I will repurchase this or not. I've tried a couple other like fragrance body washes from Jason Naturals and uh, haven't really liked it, but this one's okay. It was, it was it. And this one, you guys are no, you're no stranger to this, are you? <laughs> it's my favorite body wash. It's, I can't pronounce the brand. Is it Alafia? Alafia, Alafia. Body wash, coconut and coffee berry. Purely coconut, hydrating, normal to dry skin. And this is amazing. They did change the packaging, so it does look a little bit different. This is pretty pricey. For a body wash, it's pretty expensive. I think it's around 12 or $13. I actually can find this for around $11 at Whole Foods. So if you're ever at Whole Foods, I definitely recommend this body wash. It's really gentle, it's natural. The scent I'm not super crazy about, but you know what? I just wanna get in and get out of the shower and be done. <laughs> so it's a really nice gentle body wash and it's a hit. Of course, we love that. Next we have some makeup remover wipes. These are the Yes To Age Refresh Blueberries, I believe that's what it's called. Uh, here's what they look like. I do love these. These are really nice and gentle. I actually don't use makeup remover wipes on my face anymore, so I probably won't repurchase these, but I do really like them and they are a hit. Next, we have the Jason Vitamin E Oil 5000 IU. This is one of my favorite products ever. I actually finished an entire bottle. It took me a really long time. I already repurchased this. I love this. This is great for any dry, patchy skin, like say on your elbows or your knees. It's so nourishing. It smells amazing. I can smell it just holding it right here. Oh, it smells like avocado or like sweet almond. I actually use this on my stretched ears every single day. It's just so hydrating. It's really good for scar tissue. It just softens the skin. I mean, it's just fantastic. So, love it. It's a hit. I'm not gonna throw it because it's really sticky from like, you know, using it so much. So we're just gonna set this down over here. I have three different makeup removers. The first one here is the NYX Micellar Cleansing Water. Oh my God, you guys, this is a game changer. I will not go back to makeup remover wipes. I swear by this stuff, it is the best makeup remover ever. It's holy grail, okay, we love it. It's a hit. So these two products I use to remove my eye makeup. So this one here is from Wet n Wild. It's the Makeup Remover Micellar Cleansing Water. Now it does say you can use this for eyes, lips, and face. I would not use this on my face because I would go through this so fast. So that's what I use the NYX uh, Micellar Water for. This I use to remove my eye makeup. It also does a really good job of removing like long wearing lip color. So like liquid to matte lipsticks. It just takes that baby right off of there, super easy. My only complaint is that you only get 2.88 full fluid ounces and I feel like I go through this super, super fast. I'm almost done with my second bottle. Uh, so uh, it is really affordable though. If you can find it, like buy one, get one half off at Ulta. Stock up, it's definitely worth it. So it's a hit and I will repurchase. And then this one here is from NYX Cosmetics. This is probably my favorite eye makeup remover that I've tried in a really long time. I used to use the one from Jordana, but Jordana does not have that on their website. I can't find it anywhere, so I think it's being discontinued. Once again, 
this is just 2.8 fluid ounces i went through this very quickly but i will say this does not leave any oily residue on my eyelids it leaves my skin very soft it's very gentle on the skin but yet it removes waterproof mascara waterproof liner it's also good for again liquid lip color if you want to remove your lipstick at the end of the day um, i like the packaging i like that it's just a normal you know a dropper spout there at the top I really love this, but I think the price is way too high, so I would only repurchase this if there was like a really good sale, like 50% off or something. I would stock up on this bad boy. 100% it's a hit, but it's a little too pricey next. A little too up there in price. So next up, I have a skincare item. This is the e.l.f. Hydrating Water Essence. This is holy grail. I cannot go a single day without putting this on my skin. It just hydrates my skin and makes my skin super plump and healthy and hydrated and moisturized if you have very dry skin or sensitive skin i highly recommend this it smells amazing all the elf products smell so good it just smells like a spa it smells like you're at a spa every time you put this on it just has a little dropper here um if you guys want to see how to apply this correctly check out my skincare routine video my cruelty free skincare routine i will put it up here in the car definitely go watch it this is amazing it's a hit i have like two or three backups because i stocked up when elf had a sale yes so i have two makeup empties this one is like oh why is her hair all there is always hair all over everything when i do an empties video so this is the wet n wild mega length mascara in waterproof you guys know this is my holy real favorite mascara for my bottom lashes because it stays in place it's just it's perfect i love the wand on here it's really skinny and it's a little rubberized wand it's just perfect i don't know how else to describe it itch 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 probably messed up my foundation i just love how this applies it makes my lashes look nice and long and flirty and full on the bottom on the bottom area <laughs> so this is just one of my favorite holy grail products this is definitely a hit and then this is from elf this is the matte lip color in praline i actually was going to wear this with one of my makeup looks so i pulled this one out i was going to use it and it went bad like this smells really funky and oh yeah it smells like a really old <laughs> oh man like a musty crayon yeah so i knew that this went bad i've had this for a very long time i probably need to go through all of these and see if <laughs> any other ones went bad i do really like this color so i would definitely repurchase but honestly i really like the liquid lipstick color or version of this in praline and then the last sort of beauty makeup thing this is a pair of lashes these are the ardell double wispies i know this is going to shock you guys but i actually don't like the ardell demi wispies <laughs> something about the band on the ardell lashes i just don't like and this pair was just really weird like it wouldn't hold its shape it was kind of like weird to apply them um, they are really pretty once you do get them on your lashes, but I just, I won't repurchase. These were kind of a miss, so we're going to toss those. All right, guys, last but not least, I have two nail polish empties. Well, not nail color, but I've got a base coat. This one is from LA Girl Cosmetics. It's a hydrating base coat. This is my absolute favorite. It's a hit. And yes, I will repurchase. I have one more backup. And then the final empty product that I have is Sesh V, which is the Dry Fast Top Coat. I know this is a cult favorite, and it has been my favorite for many, many years now, but I don't think I'm going to repurchase. I love that this gives a nice, glossy, shiny finish to your nails after you're finished with your manicure, and I love that it dries super, super fast, so you can pretty much just go over your nails, and within seconds, it's already dry i'm having so many issues with this product that it's just not worth purchasing again once you get half halfway through the bottle it gets extremely thick and goopy i also noticed that it really pulls at the i guess you know how the edge of your polish here next to like the cuticle area i feel like when i apply this over top the very next day it shrinks the color and lifts my nail color uh, so I'm on the hunt for a new uh, cruelty free top coat so you guys know of any good ones please let me know I've tried so many from the drugstore I've tried LA girl I tried LA colors I tried Julie G it's a hit and also a miss all-in-one but I'm gonna say it's a miss I'm done with such feet absolutely I am I'm done with you all right guys that is everything 
Woo! That was a lot of empties. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy. And like a crazy person, I am actually going to list all of my beauty trash below in the description box if you want to shop my trash. That's kind of interesting. Shop my trash. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys have a really awesome day. Thank you so much for watching. Of course, if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I post on every Tuesday, Friday, and sometimes on Sunday. I am trying to upload three days a week. I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying. Also, if you want to come and follow me and hang out on Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter, uh, definitely come and follow me. All of my social media links are below in the description box all of my videos so definitely go follow me if you want to so i will see you all in the next video remember smarter beauty is better beauty bye guys